carrying capacity. So I am about to release a message to local police office and enforcement here in Ottawa. Right now, you have it within you, in your own discretion, to change the future of the entire world. Every one of you, as individuals, and individual capacity, as a human being, cannot deny how proud you are of these people that stand here in Parliament, because these are your people. You are so much more than the uniforms you wear. You are fathers, sons, mothers, daughters, brothers, and sisters to us all. Are you going to be able to live with yourself if you choose to follow the dictates of a corrupt and criminal, unlawful government who has displayed no respect for law, humanity, or life itself? Or are you going to be the heroes that we believe you really are? Are you going to take a chance on us and allow us, your people, the opportunity to serve and protect the freedoms of your family and your children's families? It is the love of our great nation that has brought us here, and together we stand in the face of unbelievable adversary. With great courage and standing strong, we will peacefully, in unity, throughout courage, love, overcome these challenges presented by a tyrannical government that has not that has created consistent divide. I am one Canadian amongst an entire world that can evolve into unified together as one, restoring democracy, freedom, and the rule of law. Please, for the love of God, for the love of each other, and for the love of our children, stand with us. This is our message to the law enforcement that's present here in Ottawa. We are appealing to you now because Every day, there are new challenges that we face, and every day, our movement grows and we unify. So we are officially asking the law enforcement and every police presence in Ottawa to stand with the people, because we are here standing for you. Thank you for your time. Amen. Thank you.